In this video we will discuss how to apply the namespace to a selector within a CSS document. Now we already declared our namespace and now we simply do this mod and the pipe model. That way when it goes to our XML document it only applies that style to any tag with the mod namespace. Now there is also a second method for applying the namespace and that is known as the namespace with an escape character. Down here we have our mod and the escape character backslash colon model. And that does the same thing, it just does it in a different way. Now typically we try to use both ways in a CSS document so that no matter which parser is working with it, it will recognize one or the other. And that is applying a namespace to a CSS selector. 